Would you vote for a man who can't tell you what a woman is? I, I won't. I can't. As a basic rule of thumb, if somebody cannot accept basic biological fact, then they are not fit to run a country in my book. There does seem to be a crossover in the type of people who can't tell you what a woman is and also, coincidentally, can't tell the difference between an illegal immigrant and a genuine asylum seeker either. But talking of people like that, Ed Davey, the leader of the Liberal Democrats, who, until he piped up with this nonsense and resurfed it after orchestrating a local election campaign based largely around blocking planning developments for NIMBYs, was absolutely stealing a living off the taxpayer for being the missing person of British politics. He stated that some women quite clearly, quite clearly, have a penis. Well, I don't know what women you look at, Ed, but I have news for you, mate. Women do not have a penis. They never have and they never will. Some very confused men may feel like women. I imagine some days he feels like a prime minister in waiting, but it's the same thing, isn't it? Feelings aren't reality. If you are a woman, how can you vote for a man who would... Given what he said there, presumably think a man can access your changing rooms, your daughter's changing rooms. How could he vote for that? Isn't there something totally anti-feminist about all of this as well? Men telling women what a woman is. Here's what I hear, OK, when a politician tells me that they think a woman can have a penis. I don't accept basic scientific and biological fact, and I'm not fit to be anywhere near high office.